Hey guys, Brian at Deerfield. This is a short video, but a useful video. So I get a lot of questions when people get U-bolts from me, and I'm gonna show you how I install them and why I do it this way. So when you get a U-bolt from me, this is what you're gonna get, and it's gonna have this plate right here. You also get two washers and two nylock nuts. We've already got our axle holes pre-drilled into the frame. And this goes the same for a lift kit, not just the full custom cart. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this plate, we're going to put it between the axle and the frame, take our U-bolt, put that down through there. Then we're going to take our washers on the other side, washer first, and then the nut. And that's how you want to install that U-bolt. The reason I do this is because if you look at a fish and make cart or other carts, when the axle is directly bolted to that aluminum, it will put an indention right here. So it'll actually put a bend in the frame. This plate right here, which is um, stainless steel, it's gonna strengthen that contact point right there so that you don't dent up your frame and it makes your cart stronger. So that's why I do it. That's why I get these U-bolts with this. So make sure you always put that between your axle and frame, not on the top. That's why I do the supplied washers to go on the top. And that adds a lot of strength to your cart frame right there. Hey guys, I hope that video helped out. I've had that question come up quite a few times and that's the way I do it. And that's the reason why I do it help strengthen those frames we don't want to see carts get weakened by not having that plate in there y'all have a good one